Yeah, hello there, watchy people. How is it going? Welcome back to SnowRunner. Me and Truck Tango is now caught up from the last episode. Uh, in fact, to be honest, as I stopped the last episode, you pretty much already caught up. Um, yes, we are on our way to refuel. Ah! Oh, no, no, no. There we go. It's, it's all good. It's all good. Is that, is that a bit deeper than you thought, mate? Uh, just a little bit. Well, it wasn't. It was just... I was trying to do it the easy way and it wasn't the easy way it never is um what's that light oh that's the fuel station up ahead yes, yes mate. we are we are on our way to uh, refuel our uh, previous well, you, you uh you were on your way i'm i'm here for moral support because we definitely don't need two fuel tankers that's true there. that is true I might just go as far as the fuel station and park up there. Yeah, that would that would make a lot of sense. Uh, I have used three quarters of the tank so far. Getting this far though. It's uh it's not a a gentle engine this one, it likes a good drink. Uh, now you want yeah. to put an electric truck in the game. Yeah, that would be fun actually. I guarantee you there's there's one in the mods. Surely somebody would have done that. Right. Fuel station. Fuel. Why are you fueling? <laughs> because then I have more to spare for the vehicles that need it. you got so much fuel on board, mate. I wouldn't worry about it. Yeah. Uh, anyway, yes, we, we had previously gone and collected um, some oil barrels that were lost in the river. And uh, we've got to bring them back to this fuel station. So I am on the way to go and refuel those vehicles. Um, we definitely should collect those cement bags out of the river because even if they're not necessarily the ones that Tim wants... Um, it's it's our civic duty to remove litter from the natural environment. I don't reckon Tim knows what he wants to be honest with you, mate. No. From what I know of Tim. You know what he's like, mate. It's a bit scatty. Uh, okay. I've no idea. Tim talks a big game, but he doesn't really know what he wants. <laughs> no idea where my turning is. I'm just sort of driving this direction. Uh, well, you've gone past the first one. You're going to get to the house where we found that broken Chevrolet, and that will be the second one. Then you're going to go down the hill, past some cement, and that will be your third one. Are you talking options, or which one should I take? Uh, I think you should take the third one. Right. Because the second one is going to be very twisty turny, and then if you actually do make it out successfully, it will put you behind the two vehicles. Yeah do with being in front realistically yeah because then you could fuel me and I could get out of the way and then you could fuel you yeah oh, come on the service trailer just caught on a tree there we go blimey that was a uh, an effort getting past that oh damage careful this is your second one on the right now Twisty turny one. Yeah, okay. I will push forwards. Eesh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stay upright, please. There we go. It's not that hard, is it? Oh look, there's some cement bags that we left here previously. Yep. No, I think that's where they spawned there, isn't it? Oh, really? Oh, you want to bang a right here? A right here. Doesn't even look like a road. Oh, no, it does. Okay. Past the uh, fallen trees. Hopefully, I won't get hung up on. Oh, blimey. Uh, 
Okay, if it's difficult for a bandit to get through here, it's going to be very difficult for our trucks to get through here. Uh, the bandit has a very high center of mass, though. Yeah. A little bit more, a little bit more. Good track. Oof. Yeah, there we go, back on. Oh my word. <laughs> uh, yeah, my uh, trailer's going to have fun with this terrain. Uh, also, I don't know where the hell I'm going to put this thing so that you can pass. I wouldn't worry about it. Okay. Refuel source. Maintenance frame add on. Target international. What if I reverse a bit? Uh, I reckon you'll be able to, your range will be long enough to fuel yours as well. I don't think so, no. Worth a shot? Question mark? Mm, I, I think it's too far. I mean, you can give it a go if you really want to. Or, what if, hang on a minute, what if I refuel it with my vehicle? <laughs> and then you refuel me again. All right. Wait a minute, no, hang on. <laughs> Fleet Star. Um, source. Source is international. In international, yeah. Target, Target is, Fleet, is Fleet, Star. Fleet Star. Right, Fleet Star is full. Excellent. Uh, maintenance frame add on international, yeah. There. Well done. Beautiful. The cheese. Yes. All right, now let's see where I can put this thing. Put that thing back where it came from, also help me. Oh, that, that, okay. I'm putting it there. That'll do. Uh, that sounded it, very deliberate. Yeah, it'll be fine there. That's exactly where it should be. And uh, it's totally fine. All is good. It's fine. Good. Good, good, good. We don't need to discuss it any further. No matter what you see, you're imagining it. Okay. So, Alternatively, it's just you where can swallow it, your pride and uh, understand that I have a crane. I mean, I just think it was good parking space, to be honest. It, it, okay. Well, it is a crane. Tires will be easy. It is a crane-assisted um, unparking procedure. I do admit that. Okay. Are you sure that was deliberate? <laughs> All right, you got me. It was not Maybe deliberate. I should probably get in it. Uh, no, no need. Yeah, wait till you've done it first. Whoa, 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 where are you going, truck? Handbrake, thank you. Engine off. I'm, I'm loving where my front axle is right now. That's exactly oh. where you want it to be. You are right? Oh, you are not all right. Yes, you are. Come on, I believe. That's asking a lot, that. Right. <laughs> this is hilarious. I can pretty much watch what you're doing through the gap underneath my front wheels. Alarming? Yeah. I reckon that's a good three or four feet off the ground. Oh my, um, watch what you're tipping there. Doing a great wheelie. Uh, 
What are you stuck on? Probably everything. Yeah, you've properly parked this, haven't you? Yeah. This episode is supposed to be about getting the oil barrels back. It's yeah. changed again. The last one was as well. That changed. No, I don't want the arse end of it to slide down the hill. <laughs> oh, Ooh, come on. You're tipping over. You're going to do a backflip. <laughs> ah, I'll be fine, mate. Don't you worry. Oh, my life. Rob, what have you done? Oh... Oh, oh, oh. Need more weight. Yeah. Need one of them front weights so I can farm sim. Hmm. Uh, Shall oops. we... Crane mode. Hmm. No, crane mode. Ah! I hate this game sometimes. Yeah. The controls are kind of un unintuitive. Right, that's what I wanted to do. I'm wondering if we should just leave it and come back for it with another vehicle. I mean, can you name another vehicle that would be more equipped to pull it out? Potentially another, the other bandit. Uh, you reckon? It's got a lot of grunt. If you can just drive it one direction with a toe attached. We try and crane it sideways. It's not really how cranes are supposed to be used, but I'm wondering if I could pull it backwards this way, then we could get it down onto that beach, and it'd be a bit nah, easier. The windscreen is pretty much smashed up against the front of that tree, so I don't think oh, you're going to be right. pulling it towards you at all. Okay. Now, what if I? The truck is completely moved. Uh... <laughs> Truck Come wheelies! On. That's amazing. I believe. Oh. Just hasn't quite got it, has it? Uh, just not quite got the uh, the grip to drag an entire bandit. Yeah, so heavy. I wonder if that's a recover position. Uh, whoop, oops, do that. If, if your thing isn't going to be able to do it, then I don't know what will. Let's think about this. Uh, I'd love it if I could zoom the camera out a bit more. Yeah, it'd be fantastic, wouldn't it? Because. I don't think rolling it over is going to be an option. So I think lifting it over onto the road and then rolling it over is the best play. Okay. Just I don't really know what position to be in to make that a reality. Mm. I probably need to be close to it so I don't tip over quite as easy. Yeah. Okay. Now, if I lift... front of it up. Yeah. That's looking decent. Okay, and then I lift the back around the same. Although I might be too close to it. You might be able to uh, with without with just the truck winch to the side and and drive forward. Well then pull it over onto its wheels you reckon? Yeah. Right, what I'm gonna do then is spin the crane round and extend it try and shift weight forwards. Yeah. Because it's going to want to tip, isn't it? It is. So if I do that, boom all the way out. And exit there. And winch onto the top sill. And pull me legs in. Ah, oh, beans. All right, well... <laughs> I'll try it. I'll try it anyway. I didn't mean to do that. Let's go lower range with my diff lock on. Oh come on! Oh, that looks so good then. Let's 
dragging it rather than rolling it. Yeah, it had promise for a second there, though, didn't it? It did. I uh, drive away, attach the winch, and reverse back to get some slack. Maybe I can snatch it back around onto its wheels. Mm. Go, go, go! Nah, it doesn't want to know. Uh, what if I do the same? I wonder if I can do the same on the tail. Well, from where we are now, end. it looks like if you kept pulling the front towards you, that might help spin it back. Give it a go. If I was in the right gear, I'd give it a go. Yeah. Well, it's rotating, but it's not really rolling anywhere, is it? No, but it's getting it out of that ditch a bit more. Of course, now I'm beached, so I don't have a lot of grip. Right. Come on. That's looking really good. If you can do that from the top sill now again. I wonder if I was in it as well, so I could steer the wheels. Uh, I don't think you can steer, unless the engine's running. Oh, of course. I can get the arse end to fall down the hill. So that might give me enough leverage to roll it over. Well, you've just put the arse end in front of a tree. Ah, oh, beans. I need to get, tell you what, I need to get me unstuck first, yeah. before I try anything else. Because I'm just spinning my wheels here. Uh, what can I winch off? That tree, maybe. Right, if I'm the other side of this hill, that'll be... Oh, stop, please. <laughs> yeah, you're quite a way off now. I don't know how much of this is visible. Ta-da! Hey, nice one. Right, now I can jump back in it. Start oh, the God. engine. Well done, sir. No drama. Well, there was a little bit of drama. No drama, mate. I'd, uh, you see that little road on your left there? Yeah, that's a road. Uh, that's that's an ideal parking spot for you, I think. I'm going to roll it if I try and get up there. Oh, sorry. Ow. Well, OK. I, I'm just worried about driving too far away because I'm, yeah. I was going to use this truck to help your truck. Can you drive a little bit further forward? If I must. Thank you. And then I can reverse it out that road, and then it'll be much less likely to roll. There we go. There we are. Nice and safe now. Engine off. And then uh, back to the Fleet Star. Beautiful. And hopefully, I'm now able to just drive straight through here. And not have the same thing happen. I'm not worried. I am. Look at him. There we go. Bolting through. Yeah, it's fine. It's all good. We're happy. It's fine. Right. Onward. What was that noise? A big crash behind me. Um, well, the bandit's still up on the hill, so... Yeah. <laughs> I was worried for a second. Oh, I'm very stuck on something. Uh, what can I winch off of? That free. I'm also pushing you forward. Oh, yeah, it looks like I was parked up on a log. Oh, this is very boggy, isn't it? It really is. Yeah, that's what I was noting on the way down in the bandit. My poor legs are being dragged through the mud. It's funny how much difference the steering makes. Just... 
that's seeking our way through. Oh yeah, using like the side walls for like extra traction. Yeah. At least it dries out a bit just up here. Yeah. Don't have to go too far. Ooh, I'm climbing out of it, I think. Nice. Oh, maybe not. I'm going to have a strong word with this bloke when we deliver it. <laughs> what were you, you doing down well. there? It's actually really poor payday for what the job is. Oh, no, really? Yeah. Some movement. There we go. I'm zigzagging from tree to tree. <laughs> yeah, I'm still watching that. It's working though. Well, if you can reach me, I'm in a very advantageous position. Yeah, I think I'm just outside the uh, range of you at the moment. be this one again. There we are. Just a little more. There it is. Now I should... Oh, not quite. Yeah, I got you. Nice. Lovely. Absolutely wondrous. Beautiful. And then we've got a little bit of uh, bumping about to do. Think. Something about you say? Unless that was the bit we've already done. I can't remember. There was a bit that was just like constant up and down all over the place. We do seem to just be climbing now, so I think maybe we've got through it. Yeah, I think we got through it, you know. Nice. Easy. I guess. We left this concrete here. Oh, come on. have any issue though, I just went plodding straight up it. Yeah, I'm not sure quite why. Must be to do with the weight distribution or something. There we go, I went around the wrong side but I'll take it. It works, it works. Yeah. Forward! low range for a moment. I just came out of low range and immediately regressed it. Oh. Come on, steer! No! Right, I use the winch to steer. There we go. <laughs> it's crazy. It's, my wheels are off the ground so much that I need to use the winch to steer it. Keep climbing, keep climbing. We're gonna do this. He 
you do have massive problems. You could attach the winch to me and I could be your steering. That's not a bad shout, but I'm doing okay. You're certainly catching me. Ooh, Ooh. that's quite the lean. Yeah. Come on, come on, you can do it. There we are, there we are. Anytime you want to steer left, I'm okay with that. Yeah, I'm just swinging wildly from one lean to the other at the moment. <laughs> Look where I'm going, rather than you. <laughs> you were sort of uh, crabbing there. <laughs> yeah, I think my front wheels were out of the ruts. My back wheels were falling into them. Mm. Come on. Just get this delivery done, and then we'll be in a good place. I mean, we are on the most major road in the area, so... Yeah, but it ain't a good road. <laughs> that is true. I think we've got a pretty nasty right turn coming up where the rocks are. There's a bit of a nasty overhang. Oh, I remember that. Yeah, I yeah. don't think it's too much of a turn, but it Just is... Just be a... careful about leaning over too much where you are now. Yeah. Oh, like there. Yeah, like there. Like there, yeah. Okay. I think this is the turn I'm exactly thinking of that I'm on there, or coming up on there. Yeah, you're about there we to. Go. Yeah. That's the one. Oh, steering, steering, please. Anytime. <laughs> Steering's got, a, wheel's got to be on the ground for steering, mate. No. <laughs> Yeah, you're going to have to go as far left as you dare here to get the trailer to clear. Oh, yeah, okay. But don't be afraid to winch in those off of me if you need me to do the steering for you. Yeah. Well, I need to steer away at the moment, and I can't steer at all. That's what I mean, yeah. Uh, oh, no, we're good, we're good, we're good. Are we good? Because I'm in trouble. Because I'm too busy You're looking right. behind me at you and not where <laughs> I'm going. Okay, my main concern is with rolling right now. Yeah. Actually, I think if you just like go straight where you are now, yeah, I yeah, think you'll make it. That's what I was thinking too. I think you'll be okay. What the hell am I stuck on? A tree. Uh, a tree, yeah. Trees had an existential crisis and melted through the ground. Got squished into the mud. Yep, some more winch steering. Love it. Now rock steering. Well, you are through the worst of it. Yeah, I am. Doing all right. Oh yeah. We're, we've not got a huge amount to go now. Just a couple of wet spots, I think. Yeah, I think we're plain sailing from here on out. And then we'll have finished the mission that we didn't intend to do to start with. Yeah, but we'll be close to the one we did. Yes. Going out of low range was a mistake. <laughs> right, I'll go back into low range then in that case. Keep it moving. Them doggies moving, so oh, they're just approving rawhide. I've never even seen that show. No? No, oh, right. I just know the theme tune from the Blues Brothers. They go into a country and western bar and pretend that they're the band that's been booked. And they try and play blues in there and the audience just throws bottles at them and complains. Um, and so they think the only country and western thing they can think of is uh, 
Stand By Your Man and the theme from Rawhide, so they play those. And then everybody cheers and throws bottles at them instead. <laughs> God, is that the tarmac up ahead? It looks like it could be. At the moment it feels like it's still a long way away though. Whoa, under the truck. Get your diff locks going. I've kind of run away from you a little bit, haven't I? Only a little bit. It's alright, I'm almost out of it. We're moving, we're moving. Try to understand them, just rope Paul and brand them. Soon we'll be living high and dry. I uh, can't get that out of my head now. It's stuck. Oh no. It's high and wide, actually, not high and dry, because high and dry is a bad thing. Uh, especially if you're a boat. Yeah, especially if you're a boat. Okay, I'm on the tarmac. Or well, very nearly. Beautiful, on the tarmac. beautiful. Automatic gearbox. Excellent. Up the hill, round the corner, and home. Huzzah! Well, I will have you to know get... when we, You know when we came off the river crossing? Yeah. And I said we should go right? Yeah. If we had gone left, it would have brought us to that road on your left. That's a road? Yep. <laughs> wow. That's where that road joins this road. So that's why I suggested going right rather yeah, I than think left. That was a good shout. Yep. Oh, man. I'm going to have to get the correct job selected so we can hand it in. Don't want to get some fuel while I'm here. Yeah, might as well. Beautiful. Right, let's find the job. Uh, it is threatening accident. Start tracking. Amazing. Amazing. Right, fuel station. Thank you. Refuel. And then cargo drop. Cargo management. Unload. 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 $3,500. Actually, that was better than I thought it was. I thought it was like $1,500. Still not great. No, it's still not great, but it's better than I thought, at least. Beautiful. Right. Well, I'm turning off my engine there, and I'm going to let my man go to sleep, because that is where we are going to end it. I'm going to so, go grab uh, a 24-hour hot dog, mate. Do it. Or a hamburger. Just, just I'm make sure. Hamburger, actually. Inspect it for flies when when they give it to you. Just make sure there's nothing on it. Um, at least you know, you can tell the type of establishment because um, when you've got it and you look at it, you'll notice that they've they've brushed all of the dirt from where it fell on the floor off, rather than just left it on there. Um, I think you're far too judgmental of the <laughs> Gresh Hill Gas Company. <laughs> uh, anyway, thank you very much for watching, people. Uh, don't forget to follow the links in the description. There's a one for the Discord in there, where you can come and uh, join us in conversation on a That's regular where basis. I'm always hanging out. Yeah, you're in there a lot more than me. Well, I'm in there a fair bit, to be fair. I uh, I do. I'm at the stage where it's it's not so big that I can still leave notifications on for everything. So I still see everything that people put in there. Um, I usually do respond if I'm about. Anyway. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Please leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed the video. Please uh, check out Tango on Twitch.tv and we'll see you guys next time. Bye!